Okay, audio check. Break audio check. Doing a sync check. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, we're good. We're Gucci.
Hello, good morning. Good afternoon. Let me scoot over a little bit. Hope everyone's doing well today. Um, I am wearing a sweatshirt today because I feel bloated as frick. If anybody was here yesterday, watch the first vlog. Yesterday's stream was insane. I, okay, I don't not regret it because, like, it was a fun time. But I had three regular Taco Bell freezes in the span of an hour and a half, basically. And if anybody was here yesterday, like, I was struggling. Oh my god. God, like the rest of the day, I had a crazy sugar high and like my stomach <laughs> hurt. Like I was in pain because one, I usually don't drink that much liquid in such quick succession. And also like I'm trying to cut back on like my portion sizes and how much sugar I intake. So that was like way too much for me. I honestly should have like had a smaller breakfast. So like I skipped lunch yesterday. I had dinner. But I it was I didn't yak or anything, but it was I was getting close. I was getting close. I haven't like thrown up in ages, but I I was like this I was this close to it, guys. Um I did I practiced a little bit before stream today. We can go ahead and get started. Um I do want to talk about something that happened yesterday that I'm slightly annoyed about. But I will I will get into that later. Um, I practiced a little bit before stream today because I was like, you know, I'm gonna actually practice and warm up like a real gamer. And lobbies are trash. Actual trash today. I feel that since a lot of people have downloaded the DLC, they're either making new accounts or like it's just new players. So like I've been in lobbies where it's like half the lobby is like more than 10k points and then the other half is literally people with 1k. So, ooh, okay, we okay. We can get DLC tracks in online. That's pretty pogo. That's amazing, dude. That I was concerned about that. Let's go ahead and get our first prediction of the day up. Anyway, so I did a few practice lobbies. And they were all trash. Like I actually got first for once, it was wild. Okay, yeah, did I spell believe right? Yes, I did. Good job, Megan. I I don't know what lobbies are gonna be like today. I I uh, <laughs> I honestly have no idea. But we will see. We will see how it goes. Prediction is up. Hello, welcome to chat. <laughs> it's Assassin. Oh, we're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Otherwise, feel free and chat, lurk, whatever makes you happy. Yeah, so I practiced a little bit- Oh, we got the DLC track! Nice, let's go, let's go. So, as I was saying, I practiced a little bit before stream, and like, lobbies are actual tries today. So, I might- I might get a few W's. Because I think I got one first, and then a third, and then an eighth. And like- and the lobbies I played earlier, I literally only had 100 CC. Like, it sucked. Because since I have 5 key points, I usually will have a lobby where it's, like, mirror mode or, like, 200 CC sometimes. But I've only been getting 100 CC lobbies, which kind of sucks. I mean, it feels kind of good when, like, you actually win for once, <laughs> which never happens for me. Okay, this- I'm sorry, that was a mistake. I was just anticipating that I was gonna get a mushroom there. <laughs> Yeah, when I- guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not paying attention. I know I said I warmed up today, but obviously it's not helping. Because <laughs> when I play offline, I usually will play 200cc with computers, because online can definitely get overwhelming at times. But today might be a better day. Oh, that was way too close! Let's go. Okay, we've got a solid fourth place. No! <laughs> That was mean. That's the one thing I don't like about online is like sometimes it stuff doesn't line up properly and it's annoying. Oh, okay. I've also noticed a lot of people are throwing fire behind them. Like I noticed that's a common pattern I saw today. Oh, give me a third. Give me a third. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. We got a third on our first race of the day. Oh my god. 
That's amazing. I usually like throw indefinitely when I play on stream with online. <clears throat> did I get top six? Yes, I did. Maybe we should change the prediction today to top three. Like, I think we can feel out how the lobbies are for maybe like 15, 20 minutes. And then we can change it to top three. Because like, if it's going to be like this all day, then I have confidence that I will do well. That it is not often that I have confidence. <laughs> like I said, we're gonna keep doing top six for probably 15 minutes. We'll fill out the lobbies and see how it goes. I also want to change up my stream background because like I know it's just like okay we got 150 cc there this round that's good that's good finally something something a bit more challenging oh yeah okay this is a good lobby this is a good lobby lowest guy is two key points this is good Oh my god, no. No items. No items, Sedge. But yesterday, I was playing with my sister because she- I, I'm like, making her play with me since the new DLC is out. And we started playing at I think like 6pm and we played till 8pm. Oh, guys, what was that? <laughs> and I'm definitely better than her at the game because I just play more often than she does. And it's funny, because like when she loses, she'll get like huffy and puffy, but she'll do it without realizing. So I'm like, hey, good game. And she's like, I guess. And it's so funny. And I think we played like versus mode and then battle mode for a little bit. And I was getting frustrated because in battle mode, they don't have auto accelerate enabled, I don't think. So like when we switched back to like versus and pre matches, like I, I kept on pressing A instead of B to break and I was getting so frustrated because like why why am I not breaking? Like literally why am I not breaking? But it was just silly me forgetting how to play this silly game. And usually our bedtime is like 7 or 8 p.m. because we're like actual gamers. <laughs> and <laughs> my sister was like, hey, why don't we do a 24 <laughs> map of pre right now? And I was like, bet. And <laughs> We did teams, and <laughs> the computers on both of our teams were like sucky and then good, so like she was in the lead, so she's like, ha, I'm gonna win. And then like halfway through, like my team like finally caught up, cause like I was hard- I was hard carrying my team. And so she was starting to get upset. Okay, I threw, I actually threw right there. And <laughs> I would ask her every single race, be like, you, you still think you're gonna win? She's like, yeah, I still think I'm gonna win. And I was like, bet. I was like, 20 bucks. She's like, no shot, no way. And then up until like the final round, she's like, I'm, I think I'll win, I think I'll win. But we got to like the second to last race and I had a solid 40 point lead on my team and she's like, um, I don't think I'm gonna win now. <laughs> yeah, as I was saying, I think I want to change up my background because right now, um, background is just like the white wall and then lights. I don't like, like, the... RGB lights as much. Like, I think they're kind of cringe. Hot take, hot take. But that's because, like, everyone has those colored lights, right? I definitely, because, like, I think, like, brighter, like, more natural lighting looks better, in my opinion. But I think what I want to do is get butcher paper and, like, because on camera, it only shows, like, this much. So, like, maybe a three by four rectangle of this wall. Oh, I keep on forgetting to put what place I get. <laughs> I think I got 10, right? Yeah, I got 10 that round, Sag. But yeah, I think what I want to do is like paint a new butcher paper mural on the wall every month. So I'm still thinking about it. There we go, new prediction is up, guys. <clears throat> I think I want to add a little bit of color to my background. 
but nothing too crazy. Because I don't want like the colors to clash too much with what I'm wearing. But I don't want it to be too much, you know what I mean? Because I definitely need to be doing art more. And I know I said, I know I said I'm going to start doing like art streams on TikTok, but like I honestly haven't been feeling it. Because the UI on TikTok Live is not as good as it could be. Like definitely going from like Twitch UI to like TikTok UI, like it's not good. The moderation tools are not there. It's not as intuitive, so. Okay, we got one guy with the greens. <laughs> so I, I think I kind of want to hold off on it. It'd be pretty pogo if TikTok would launch their desktop version of live streaming, like a software for that, for like most creators instead of a select few for beta. Like that would be amazing. Because I definitely like I've been trying to draw a bit more off stream. Like I'm trying I'm trying to break out my India ink, so hopefully I'll be able to break out my scanner and post them on my um, um, Instagram soon. Hi cutie Lee, welcome to chat. <laughs> Hope we're doing well today. Let me just say only cutie Lee can call me that, okay guys? Okay? No weirdos in chat. <laughs> but I hope we're doing well today, man. Yeah, so like, I should be able to- Oh my god! <laughs> I think I want to try and get one, like, test background done by not next week, but maybe the following week. To see what it looks like on camera. Doing side work? On go. You know, multitasking. ADD brain, you know? Okay, come on. I can catch up. I can maybe get a fourth right here. Another star? Why? Okay, we got a four. That's pretty good. Because I think what I want to do for like the mural with the butcher paper is do like pattern work. I don't want to do like an actual, like I think a portrait would be interesting, but I think that's a bit much. So I think I want to do like abstract pattern work. I think that would look pretty. Hey you, I will be right back. Someone's at the door. Sag. Probably, probably a package, I don't know. I am good. I am back. It was a package. But it was FedEx. Surprisingly, we didn't have to sign, so I could have just left it on the porch. Oh. <laughs> but it's best not to do that. Anyway. I like the DLC, too. Like, I think... Um... I don't have any, like, friends who are, like, into Mario Kart, unfortunately. Kitty Lee, you need to play with me. Add me after stream, did. Oh, wait. Should I... Okay, um... Oh, we got an elaborate. Okay, we don't have to expect it. Good, good, good. I definitely like how the graphics and the aesthetic is reminiscent of the old games. I definitely like that a lot. Like, I know people are ragging on it, but like, oh, the graphics aren't good. It's not fully rendered. But it's like, that's not the point. Like, it's, it's, it's an artistic aesthetic choice. Like, I think it looks good. And like, it looks like toys, which I really like the aesthetic of, personally. We got 60 and believe. Let's go. Any doubters? Doubters mod check. <laughs> yeah, 
You have me in audio only? That's fine. <laughs> I don't care. I know, like, when I watch streams, like, there's some people who I will, like, sit and watch and type in chat. Like, i.e. Like, a stream that I mod for, alright, I chat a lot in... Like, Connery's pants, but I will just, like, type emotes. I don't, like, actually chat. If I have a joke, I'll, I'll try it. But, like, I used to just emote spam in Connery's chat. But most of the time, because I like white noise, so I will have a stream on in the background. So, like, if anybody who has me on Twitch, like, as a friend, you'll see me just watching Hassan all day. But in actuality, I just have him on in the background. Oh, yeah, mobile viewing on Twitch is actual trash. I don't understand how, like, it's not there yet. I wish there was a way to download safely. I know there's like, I know there's emulators you can get. Oh, dude, I drifted the wrong way. <laughs> to like enable the BTTV rank and then 7TV emotes for mobile. Like, I know there's a separate app you can get for it, but like, why isn't it integrated on the Switch app? I don't, why isn't it there yet? You know? <laughs> so like, if I'm watching a stream that I'm not gonna chat in, that's the only time I'll use mobile. But if I'm chatting, I have to be on desktop. It's just the user experience is so much better on desktop. Like, I used to be exclusively a mobile viewer Andy, but then I tried on desktop and, like, I cannot go back. Oh! <coughs> okay, that was close. Got me six. I feel like I'm further ahead, but I'm not. I feel like my drifts aren't like getting like aren't getting as well. Oh my god, I'm in eleventh place, guys. I am sorry. <laughs> Imagine modding on mobile. <laughs> on mobile, do you see like the automated messages, or do they not show up at all? So I was curious about that. Because I get so anxious if I'm modding for someone, like, I have to be on desktop. Because I feel like if I'm on mobile, like, that's the one time something will happen. Granted, I, I don't think I've ever had a time where I've modded and, like, something bad has happened. Thank god. Oh my god, they stuck me. How is everyone so much better than me at this game? Okay, gotcha. But it's still, like, very limited. Which is fine. Like, I know not everyone can be on desktop, so that's totally okay. And, like, I'm usually pretty quick with, like, automated messages anyway. Because even if I don't read chat out quickly, right away, or right away, I'm, I still read it. Because I'm not a streamer who will, like, read a message right away without, like, pre, pre like, approving it in my head. Oh my god, I got fucking temp. Oh my god. <laughs> that is embarrassing. <laughs> Um, so usually, I will like read it in my head, wait like five seconds before I respond to it. Because I know most people have a delay anyway. But. Because I'm just so scared, because like it- People will like say stuff to debate you just to farm clips. And like I know that's part of like streaming culture. But it's just like, I'm not for that, you know? Okay. New prediction is up guys. Also, if anybody is new to chat and you can't see the emotes, I would definitely, if you're on desktop, recommend downloading the extensions right here. <laughs> um, so you can download the BTTV, Banker Face Z, and 7TV. They're all free extensions. So if you see, like, just weird words that don't make sense, they're probably just emotes that you can't see unless you have an extension. So download those, guys. It makes your viewing experience so much better. Anyway, I'm trying to just plug the extensions more. I'm not being paid or anything. It's just like, I want my chat to just be emote spammers. That's literally what I want. That's all I want. <laughs> yeah, get good. <laughs> Honestly, I, I farm some- Because, like, if I farm clips for you, Katie, then you have content to repost. Okay? That's why that's why I farm a little bit. <laughs> I think it's just funny. Hi, Dads. Hope we're doing well today. I'm doing pretty good. I am very tired. I am still, like exhausted from yesterday's stream 
Um, if, if you were around the downs, I know I ran it out to you. That was pretty pago. I need to see the character. I need to like rewatch the VOD of yours and like see the final character that you made for me downs. But I, I chugged three talk about slushies yesterday on stream and I wanted to die. <laughs> Like, my stomach was in pain the rest of the day. But I, I feel good today. I'm still, like, very tired. Okay, because one of my friends, he works night shift, and he walks home, unfortunately, because he doesn't know how to drive, and, like, um, no one wants to drive him home, which is annoying. Anyway, so, like, I will, like, talk to him on the phone as he's walking home, because it takes, like, two hours for him to get home sometimes. Because, like, just the bus systems suck here in the States. So, like, um... I was on the phone for him for a little bit, so I didn't go to get off the phone until like 1.30. And then I woke up early as usual. <laughs> so I'm, I'm just infinitely tired, guys. If you guys ask what I'm doing, I'm most likely going to say tired. But lobbies are going to be interesting today. As I said earlier, I assume there's just a lot more newer players or people who are starting new accounts to practice the DLC. So... Lobbies? I don't know how to- OH! DUDE! <laughs> That was rude. Lobbies are gonna be interesting. <laughs> she looks like a real meanie. I am so excited to see it. <laughs> because, like, it's fun to see, like, your, I guess, interpretation of, like, your friends. <laughs> like, I think it's also funny how you said, like, I didn't know what Merc means. Because, <laughs> like, I wanted my, um, I guess, application. To be kind of trolly and funny. Like, I put my occupation as pro Fortnite player. <laughs> um, if anybody doesn't know, Downs is making custom characters for his viewers and other streamers in the new um, WWE game. So definitely check it out. It's 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 a fun time watching him make characters, honestly. Oh, okay, I drifted the wrong way. <laughs> He's safe, they didn't fall off. Okay, this is lap three. I should start trying now. <laughs> I'm I'm literally so far behind right now. Oh my god, lightning bolt! Okay, okay, game changer. Let's see, let's see. <gasps> okay, ten. <laughs> okay, that, that's still an L. That's that's actually really bad. Sorry, believers. I know I said lobbies were bad today, but honestly. Maybe practicing before stream did not help. <laughs> <clears throat> I feel like my voice- Ooh, Tokyo Blur. I think Tokyo Blur is like, the lamest track from the DLC. Because like, the line is way too simple in my opinion. That, that I think that's the, the weakest track in the DLC, TBH, TBH. Your new prediction is up, guys. <clears throat> but like, I feel like my voice is different today. Thoughts? It feels deeper. I don't know. Maybe just having all the perpetual syrup from the slushies ruined my vocal cords. Like it just got stuck in my throat. I don't know. <laughs> Guys, we got a hundred and ten in doubt. Come on, I need some believers. <laughs> I don't need you. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is a good lobby right here. Nobody is low level. We'll, we'll see, we'll see. Oh my, I did too late, I did too late. A quick PSA I want to say. Because, um, yesterday my stream f because the router just like bricked itself halfway through stream. And it took like a minute or two to get, like, reset the router, like get everything back up and running. But during the second half of my VOD, I think there was an issue with like encoding or processing, like uploading to Twitch. So like the whole second VOD is just drop frames and audio skipping. And like it looks fine on your broadcasting end, like if you're on Twitch Studio or OBS, like it looks fine on your end. So like we don't really know or what's aware of what's happening on the actual like Twitch website. So if you're watching a small streamer, keep in mind, they don't have like a whole production team, right? It's usually just them in their room. So if you're in a small streamer's chat, and you notice that something is wrong, or like something isn't as it usually is, 
please tell them. <laughs> it might seem don't it's it's not annoying. I will be honest, it's not annoying. They will appreciate it. <laughs> so <laughs> if you notice something off or wrong, like say something. I, I know I don't think it's annoying. I'd rather people say something than me going for an hour and a half not knowing that the audio is crap. Because basically, because the challenge streams it's meant to be like edited down. I know! I know! It's so frustrating, isn't it, Downs? Like, I will go, like, sometimes I will, like, browse the Discover tab to, like, see what's up, right? And, like, I have to say, like, a solid 25% of streams, they're muted. And it's like, homie, I understand that's an honest mistake, but, like, how has nobody told you? Like, I will, like, be in chat for, like, two minutes, like, lurking before I say something. Like, maybe, like, times where, like, you would, and usually it's people who have no cam on, so, like, you can't tell if their mouth is moving. <laughs> what did I get? I got a third. Good job doubting Downs. <laughs> I almost put doubt as the outcome. Oopsie. <laughs> but it's like, how can nobody... How does nobody feel inclined to say something? It, it's so, like, aggravating to me. Like, especially as someone who is small and who doesn't have many active mods or, like, active viewers. Which is fine. I don't care if I'm a one viewer Andy. Like, that's totally fine, I get it. But, like, how is- How come nobody said anything? <laughs> I know, I know, like, I will- I will always, like, glance, like, I stream on my laptop, right? Oh, I need to pick a course. Let's do Shy Guy Falls. It's like, I have so many- I stream from my laptop, and I have so many different tabs over right now. Like, I have my Twitch studio, I have my Twitch stream open so I can actually see the live that, of what you guys see. And then chat. And then all my other, like, background stuff. Like, I have a lot going on on my single monitor. Everyone keeps telling me to, like, just get another monitor or, like, get a real PC. And I'm like, nah, I love my Alienware laptop. Hashtag not sponsored. <laughs> Hashtag not an ad. <laughs> and it's like, I'm always, like, looking at everything. Because, like, my biggest anxiety is, like, everything failing. Because I try to do everything in my control to, like, make sure everything is good for stream with, like, what I have. <laughs> Three screens still muted, so I'm sag down, sag. Um, <laughs> if I'm in your stream dance and something is wrong, I promise I will tell you. I will tell you, Downs. <laughs> um, I know in, like, bigger streamers' chats, like, they, they will get annoyed if something- if, like, people are, like, saying way too dang, or, like, calling out issues all the time. But, like, if you're smaller, it's usually- like I said earlier, it's usually just you in your room. And I think a lot of viewers don't realize that, because they expect so much from people who are just starting out. But it's usually- people are still learning how to use software, still learning like audio technician, that type of thing. So like, try and be like understanding, be helpful, you know? Or like, okay, also, I've been in a few smaller people's streams. Dude. And like, they will specifically ask chat, be like, hey, is everything good? Or like, is my camera good? Or is my audio good? And they will not say anything. And it's like, bruh, if, if I'm, like, desperate enough to ask if everything is good, please respond to me. <laughs> like, just reassure me, please. Oh my god, no way, Downs. I am so sorry. But it's like, yeah, like, how come nobody told me? I don't- Okay, I know it's putting partially, like, blame on chat, but honestly, guys, if you want good content, like, I I'm, I'm being honest, if you want, like, the best content possible, like, call out things as needed. Or, like, if something Fs, like, tell us. That's my tech talk. Thank you, guys. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That bomb scared the shit out of me. And I think, um, as I said earlier, like, I always have, like, a monitor or, like, a tab open of my stream. So that's why I don't necessarily look at my camera as much. Like, I'm always looking at my monitor. And I know I should be looking at camera more. You know, like, actually looking at you guys. I'm getting used to it, though. It definitely, when I first started, um, I couldn't do gaming streams, so it was just me, like, drawing, doing art streams. So, it, like, it was just, like, um, I didn't have face cam until I started playing games. And even now, like, I'm still... Okay, I, at least I got an item box. I'm still getting used to, like, being on camera. I'm definitely a lot more confident now. But it took me a long time to get to that point. So, like, anybody who is new or just starting out, like, don't feel bad. If you're, like, 
not amazing right away. Like, it, it's definitely, like, a learned skill. Right? Oh my god, get away from me! Get away! Top four? Top four, imagine? Dude, I... <laughs> I love that last turn. <laughs> were, were you muted as well? Oh no. Imagine. That sucks, dude. I would never... I would be saying something like eight downs. It's been 20 minutes, sir. <laughs> I think, okay, I think what is helpful. I don't know if you have, your starting student doesn't have audio. Oh no. Um, what I have on my starting student screen, I'm going to switch to it real quick. I have a timer. I saw like this recommendation from other streamers. Um, let's choose a course. Why is gold mine? Obvi. And like if you have a timer and people see that the timer is like ending like they yes They will bait you like oh you're late. You're late, but then they also have an idea of when you're starting So like if I'm in your chat and I see that your uptime is like 15 minutes But the timer has been out for like five minutes. I'm like, okay. Um, what's going on? <laughs> what's going on dude? <laughs> that sounded so much like miss impression of XQC <laughs> Um, I think maybe adding a timer might help with that. Or, like, prevent that from happening again. <clears throat> Ooh, okay. okay, that's a new account. They only got 1k points. What are you doing, dude? <clears throat> like I said yesterday, I was playing with my sister, and I kept on mixing up the brake and the acceleration button, and I basically forgot how to play this track. Okay, I think I got it now, because, like, I kept messing up the turns, like, every single time. You know, okay, what I have noticed since the DLC has come out, I think I saw another person say this as well, but, like, the items, like, the distribution seems better. Thoughts? And also, online lobbies seem to be better, like, I guess, like, the delay isn't as bad. Like, it's like a minuscule difference, but it feels like a little bit better. Heading into lap five. Doing pretty good. I've got a solid fifth place. No! Okay, this is just rude. I, I had a solid fifth. I was doing decent. <laughs> How am I in last place? I am so sad right now. You guys do not understand. <laughs> no. Just end it, please. End, end me. Okay, also, when I'm tired, I'm a lot more giggly. <laughs> if y'all don't know. Okay, let's update our leaderboard. Let's add our first 12th. Oh my goodness. Our first 12th of the day. Sag. Okay, new prediction is up, guys. And if anybody is new to chat, if you don't know how predictions work, check out this Twitch help article. It explains what channel points are, along with how predictions work. <laughs> because I me as, a, um, me as a viewer I definitely would like to see streamers utilizing like channel point predictions a lot more because my favorite part about watching a Mario Kart stream is either rooting or like doubting the streamer. It is so fun um anyway that's, that's my TED talk check out that article if you are confused of what predictions or channel points are. I think it's a really like fun way to interact with chat. Ooh, mirror mode. Okay. Oh, I hate mirror mode on this track. Because just the lines are so difficult on their own. Like I have them all memorized. But mirror mode? Ugh. I have lint on my jacket. Okay, we're good. <laughs> oh, we got 10 in doubt. Oh, that was last prediction, Sag. Never mind. 
Ignore me. <laughs> I was playing with my sister last night, and as I said, like, we played until, I think, 8pm, 8, 8 and 7pm is our normal bedtime. We're adults, but, you know, we're, <laughs> we're boomers. And when we both get tired, we are, like, overly dopey and giggly. And I have noticed, since I have started streaming, when, we, when I watch movies or play games with my sister, I am extra- I am extra as fuck. Like, I am so fucking annoying. <laughs> like, I will commentate my- my gameplay when I play with her. So, like, I will- I will be just as loud <laughs> and annoying. And, like, she doesn't mind it anymore. Like, she thinks it's kind of funny. But usually, like, if, if I'm saying, like, stupid shit, she'll get annoyed. But last night, we were so tired. That she was just like laughing at everything I was doing because like I, I I fake getting mad with her because she she thinks it's really funny. <laughs> like I will stop my feet, I will like yell really loud, and usually she finds it annoying. But she was just like laughing her ass off, laugh, laughing her ass off like all night long. <laughs> Guys, that was rude. And okay, and her go-to bit was <laughs> anytime she like did a trick or like did something cool she would say oh yeah beast mode <laughs> like i don't know where she heard that phrase from so she would like like snipe someone with the green shell and be like oh yeah beast mode <laughs> and like i don't get it i'm like where have you heard that she's like i don't know i just made it up i'm like are you like quoting mr beast or something she's like not it i just think it's funny <laughs> Okay, mirror mode is actually messing me up on this one. Did <laughs> Because what's nice is with my sister, like, we used to be really- we're both really quiet and introverted, but we've definitely started, like, getting closer recently. And it's nice. How'd that guy fell up? Sag. I got another temp. I think- okay. Anybody who streams. Or, like, plays games. Isn't it more difficult to, like, concentrate when you're streaming and playing a game? Like, you know when you watch, like, sh FPS players? Like, people who play Valorant or, um... I don't know shooter games, so I, I just know Valorant. <laughs> they, they usually don't talk a lot, which is fine. Because, like, they're actually, like, concentrating and playing in the game. That's why I will never, never, ever play, like, a game that I need to, like, concentrate 100% at. Because I would be so focused on, like, just saying somewhat funny and cringe things as I'm playing the game. <laughs> like, I've thought about playing Mario Maker on stream, but I feel like even that is, like, a bit too much, like, concentration. Like, I'd actually have to, like, focus. <clears throat> I didn't clean my glasses today. Rip. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm not gonna talk this around to prove my point. Actually, maybe not. <laughs> My, my earbud is falling off. It's falling off. I had to fix it, I had to fix it, but I, I probably threw this game because of it. Because for some reason, like, the traditional earbuds, they, they've never fit well in my ear. I do not know what's up. <gasps> no! <laughs> oh my god, did you- I like ducked because I got so scared. I ruined the drift at the end there. Oh, dog! <laughs> there was there was a ghost. <laughs> did, did you see the fire hit the mushroom? It went blind. It. 
Hey, welcome to Chad Doctor. Hope you're doing well today. Found me from TikTok? Imagine. But that's cool. That's actually pretty cool, man. Um, if you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Otherwise, feel free to chat, lurk, whatever makes you happy. But I'm glad the TikTok... I'm glad you like the content. Th those eggs scare me so much. <laughs> Oh my god, that was unfair. Okay, we're not we're not talking the rest of this lap. I'm gonna win up. Oh, oh okay, we got a bullet. Why is it going this way? Why is it going this way? Oh my god, what the fuck? That's bullshit. Stupid AI. Okay, a homie threw one fire behind him, and it happened to snipe me. Come on, give me a fourth, give me a fourth. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. okay let's do a cut here. Oh my god, oh my god, holy shit! Oh, I thought- I thought it was- I... <laughs> Who got first? Who got first? Oh my god. I- it looked like I was gonna get first! That was wild. That was crazy. My life is a movie, guys. <laughs> yeah, that's what I Okay. I honestly started playing Mario Kart again because of streamers as well. Because, like, one, Mario Kart is just really fun to watch. Like, it's so engaging. Like, as you saw in this race, like, I had, what, 8th place? Then I got a solid 2nd because of that bullet, even though the bullet bill kind of screwed me over. Um, what are they doing? But I think- Especially with the DLC. I'm so excited. That switch. Okay. <clears throat> go. Okay, new prediction is got is up, guys. Let's see. We did DK jungle already. Let's do we already we, we already did Sunshine Airport too. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I like the DLC a lot. I- because my first Mario Kart game was on the Wii, so like, I don't have like the nostalgia factor of like the 3DS games, like N64. But I just like the aesthetic of the DLC tracks. Because like, they look- the lighting and like the 3D models, they look like toys, and I like it a lot. It's a lot more brighter saturated colors, so aesthetically I like it. Um, some tracks are a bit too simple, but I definitely like the ones- that have so many different paths, like um, Ninja Hideaway, I think, and then I also like the mechanic of how like the final lap will change. I think that is really interesting. Why do we get Baby Park again, uh, dude? What are they? I <laughs> grew up on Nintendo nines. I'm like ninety nine, so I'm still a nineties kid, but I'm I'm a I'm a fake, you know. <laughs> okay, we're not gonna get literally last this time. Watch me get no items. <laughs> Dude, give me something, please. Dry Bowser. Let's cancel him, guys. Okay, we can fi finally three laps in an item box. Okay, back up to fifth, let's go. Oh my god, I did the same thing last time! I, I never- I, I literally never do well on Baby Park. I think it's because the the two single turns that are in the rack- or, or that are in the track, they're almost too wide. Because, like, my- my best lines are the lines that are, like, curvy or, like, S-shaped. 
Oh, I almost put I got top six. <laughs> Oopsie. What did I get? I, I think I got like 10. No, I got ninth. I got ninth. Savage. But like my best lines that I'm the best at is the ones where I can like quickly drift and like turn midair. Like I've gotten really good at Neo Bowser City. Like surprisingly good at it. Like I finally learned how to do the turn. Okay, hey, new prediction is up, guys. I think we have time for maybe three or four more games of Mario Kart. I'm going to go ahead and switch gears to Animal Crossing. <laughs> Bro, I've gotten two scam calls today. What is going on? <laughs> oh, we got 60 and believe. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, Coconut Mall. Let's go. I love this track. This is my favorite track on the Wii version. I'm so glad they have it in the DLC. Village tour? Um, my village... <laughs> Since you're new to stream, I deleted... Sorry, there's a bug in my window. And it's scaring me. We're fine, we're fine. I deleted my Animal Crossing two months ago, back in January. And so I'm still in the beginning stages. I haven't gotten KK to my island, so I can't ter terraform yet. So the island does not look good, but maybe, <laughs> maybe we could do a door. Okay, we got a solid third place. Let's go. See if we can hold. Ah, I should have held. No. I, I do not need a super horn right now. I know people were upset about the cars not moving, but I honestly don't care. I'm just glad we got Pokemon Mall. Pokemon Mall. Okay, that was a mistake. <laughs> Hello, baddie. Welcome to chat. We're doing well today. Oh, you put Believe? Let's go. We got another Believer in Jet. Imagine. Everyone is, like, nice today. Okay, stop. <laughs> Dude, I need to get better with my lines. Oh my god. No! Yeah, that was rude. The banana just spawned out of nowhere. You got a gift and sub? Let's go. Let's go. Enjoy your ad previewing and sub emotes. Okay, come on. I, I just gotta go up three places. Three places. That's it. Literally three places. Okay, someone needs to throw. Okay, top three, top three. No! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Okay, come on, double item box. Let's see, let's see. Okay, okay, come on. No, no, come on! I'm literally right there! Okay! Okay, I'm happy with that sixth place. It was looking like a seventh. We got a sixth, guys. Look at that. Believers for the win, finally. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Imagine the one time nobody doubts I actually win. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think we'll do three more games of Mario Kart. Okay, new prediction is up, guys. Oh, I didn't pick one, Sag. Um, I was in a match earlier before stream, and I wasn't queued up, so I was spectating, and there was a player named Dad. <laughs> I 
I, I, I took a video of it. It was, it was so funny. <laughs> like, I, I was trying to think of, like, a funny meme I can make. But, like, Dad? <laughs> Bro, what was that even? It didn't hit anything. I love Mario Kart. God. Oh, there we go. Okay. I'm still freaking out, like, what, what is the best, like, line to make on this track. I mean, that one was pretty good. That was really tight. Let's go. I wish in the DLC they changed the stupid blue shell mechanic to fly in the air instead of traveling on the ground. They should have changed that. But let's get a petition going, guys. Cause it, it's such. <laughs> it it's not cool. Like whoever decided to change that in the writer room, actually psychotic. Okay, we can catch up copium. Okay, <laughs> hey, just let me ram some people, please. You got one guy? Okay, we're in sixth place. Oh my god, oh my god. A Nick trying to snipe us. Nice try, buddy. Oh, let's go for the gun! Let's go for the gun! No! No, please, please! Okay. Hey, we got, we got fit. <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. No! Doctor, you are literally evil. Don't do that. It's not like you can aim with the blue shell, right? Wait, what did I get? I got fifth, I got fifth, okay. Intentionally hitting people with a blue shell is psychopath behavior. <laughs> I need to practice Coca Mountain more. Now, I think Coca Mountain has the hardest lines out of all the tracks in the DLC. Okay, second to last prediction is up for the day, guys. Go place your bets. <clears throat> I think I'm also gonna be playing a different game on stream tomorrow. I don't I think I don't wanna play Unite on stream anymore. It depends. Um if I can afford to buy the game tonight. <laughs> um, I- okay. Anybody who doesn't know, I do my sister's chores for her, so I'm basically like her housemate, so she gives me like 50 bucks a week to do her chores. So I- um, that's my income. <laughs> so I'm gonna like beg and plead to get paid early so I can buy a video game to play. So I think I'm gonna get- if I- if we are doing a new stream- Yeah, free money. Untaxable income, baby! What game I want? I want to get um, Super Mario 3D World with the Bowser's Fury game. So if I'm able to purchase it tonight, because we're playing tomorrow. Because the only Super Mario game- is this- Oh, this is- this, this is 200cc, I think. Oh my god, let's go. I love 200cc. Or maybe this is just 150. I don't know. If so, I like it. It's faster. Because the only Super Mario game I've played was the Wii. The Super Mario Brothers Wii. So, like, it'll be my first playthrough of the game. Dude, I'm in first. How how did this happen? Please, nothing bad happened. Please. Okay, we got him. Easy clap. What? I know I said this was, like, Millie's favorite track on the DLC, but I like how short it is. It's very quick. Bro, give me something better. Oh my god, I have such an insane lead right now. Oh my god. 
Okay, this right here is the least, my least favorite part. It's like too wide a line, similar to Rainbow Road. It's too wide a drift. Oh my god, look at me! This first, guys? My first first of the day? Look at that. Yeah, oh my god. Imagine. <laughs> yeah, easy clap. <laughs> who is she? Megan who Megalo. <laughs> okay. Uh, should we just end here? Like, end on a high note? Well, no, no, no. I, I said I'd do one more. I'll do one more. Okay, let's see. Does anybody in chat like Cheese Land? Okay, I kind of want to run a poll, actually. Okay. So our last prediction is up for the day. Our last Mario Kart of the day. What is Cheese Land? What? It's that yellow course. It's icky. It's icky. It sucks. Because, similar to like American infrastructure, there's pit holes in the course. So like, they always mess up your drifts unless you trick off of them. It's not- it's not a fun course. I- I do not like it. I have not met anybody who likes Cheeseland. So let's go ahead and get that poll going. Oh no. <laughs> Cheeseland good? Nah, no way. Or he is. It's I- Are you playing Cheeseland? Thank fucking god we're not. Okay, poll is up guys. Poll is up. Go vote, vote, please. There we go. <clears throat> I think it's easier. Like, if you're playing with a pro controller, it's so much easier to handle. Oh, dude. Take snipe that green shell right at the. <laughs> Mike cannot talk. No, 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 no. We're not talking about dish, dude. Unless you mean dishing out these W's, am I right? <laughs> okay, let's go. I'm actually doing surprisingly well. It's it's very rare. Okay, get away from him. I have like top three this early on. Actually, never mind. We're back in fifth. Okay, I, I need to start picking up points. I pick up literally none. <laughs> I wish we could have gotten Cheese Land. That way it can prove to you guys how horrible Cheese Land is. Stay away from me. Okay, we're good. Okay, somebody put a banana right in between the coins. That's actually a pro move. Shout outs to them. For playing mean, but playing the win. <laughs> Guys, stop. What is going on? Oh, I didn't even get to trick jump off of there. Oh, okay, I thought that was a red shell. I almost went for it. Or, not a red shell, a mushroom. I almost went for it, but it was a red shell. Can you give me some gun? Okay, I- what is wrong with me today? I cannot talk. Maybe I still have that sugar hack mystery. No items. End me. Any video game. Oh, six! A six! Okay, we got a fifth. Good job, believers. You guys win. You guys win. You guys win. Good job. <clears throat> okay. That was fun. That's fine. I- okay. Let's see, let's see. Let's get out of here, let's get out of here. <clears throat> let's see how we did today. Let's see, I, I gotta like, get close to my screen. Okay, I said- I, like, I did pretty good today. Like, I got one first, one second, two thirds, a fourth, a fifth, or a few fifths, a sixth. A big handful of tenths, mind you. But that's pretty good. It's pretty decent for an online match. Like, as I said at start of stream, today's lobbies, it definitely, there seems like a lot of newer players playing online as of recent. So, I did pretty good. That's pretty pogo. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and switch gears to Animal Crossing. So, I'm gonna go switch out the cartridge, because my sister likes physical games. 
So, give me like a minute. Chat amongst yourselves, you know. Have fun making friends. <clears throat> My switch is so hot right now. Like it's surprisingly warm. We are good, we are back. Yeah, let's think of a good title. What can we do? What can we name this? I'm trying to think of like something to name villagers, like filling up filling up the island. <laughs> Homie thought maybe the course called Cheese Land is made of sand, but the course is yellow. You're, you're fine. It plays just like a sand level, though. That's why I hate it. Okay, what should we call this? What should we call this? <laughs> oh my god, we got a penguin! Oh my god. Sorry, I haven't played. I only play on stream. So I... I, like, I only play on stream, so like, I don't know what happens on the off days. Uh, I'm trying to think of like mixing pot, mixing pot. My island is a mixing pot. History references, let's go. What was that animated show called? Um, oh, what was it called? It would talk about like history, the bill, the bill. And, like it had songs as animated. What was it called? School House Rock, right? Schoolhouse Rock, is that what it's called? School of Rock? Oh, I was close. I was close. I Yeah, I think that's what it's called. School of Rock. Schoolhouse Rock? Something like that. Okay. I'm changing our title right now. <laughs> Maybe. I have, Okay, I, I literally have to look that up right now. That's gonna bother me. Animal Crossing. Because there was one song talking about, like, the Declaration of Independence and then school... And I just thought of the mixing pot song. Schoolhouse Rock. We, we were close. We had it. We had it. Schoolhouse Rock. That's what it was. Okay, let's play the game now. <clears throat> Anybody new to stream Animal Crossing usually a bit more chill? I try and calm down after playing Mario Kart. So, like, it's usually more just chatting. So, like, feel free. Like, ask questions. Talk about stuff you like. I'll talk about stuff I like. I usually... Okay. <laughs> Everyone clowns on me because I will, like, if playing Stardew Valley or, like, Animal Crossing makes me think about stuff, right? Because you're just, like, zoning on playing. Like, I always will go into, like, a public transportation rant. So, look forward to that, guys. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> Hello there, everyone. Right now in Timbaland, it is 12.05pm on Wednesday, March 23rd, 2022. Now for today's announcements. Today, we have a visitor staying at the campsite. I hope our guest is able to see what it is that makes Tiblin such a special place. That's all for now. I hope you all enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. Oh, I'm so excited to meet the penguin. Because I think they just showed up. I don't think... I don't think we got them from an island. Oh. Um... I just wanted to make sure to thank you, Megan. They say you've been trying to get Kiki to notice our island, so he'll come before me, Snacky. Snacky sounds like a derogatory term. Let's move on. <laughs> I'm grateful to have you trying to make this happen, Megan. Between you and me, I think I might be the biggest Kiki fan on the island. Actually, I have something right here that might help. I thought maybe you could use my Miss Flamingo here. For your big chill and promotion, I mean. Okay, let's go ahead and place that right now, actually. 
Which house is theirs? Yeah, I think I th I think you were in chat last week, Batty, and we were talking about like enabling emotes. I can't remember if it was you who said it, but I enabled the seven TV emotes. So have fun with those guys. Oh, her house is right here. L let's place something and go right in front of their house. Yeah, right here. Like I try to enable the ones that I find are funny. <laughs> Or the ones that I like seeing being spammed. I think my favorite- okay, let me actually look at them. If anybody doesn't know or is new to, like, Twitch, if you see, like, text that makes no sense, it's most likely an amount. So download the BTTV, Frank or Facey, and 7TV extensions on desktop. I think my favorite 7TV one- it has to be Colleen. Colleen is so funny. <laughs> okay, let's continue on. I think we have one more. Yeah, we have one more empty plot, so we can probably take care of our flowers, harvest resources. Oh, oh we can get a new fit. We can get a new fit. <laughs> Good afternoon, Megan. Thanks for stopping by. How can I help you today? What's on sale, man? You got it. Here's what I'm selling today. Ooh, new fit, guys. Ooh, let's see. Let's see. I know, same, Batty. Like, I was, like, just even finding, because, like, I think you can have, like, 200 slots. But, like, even just finding, like, 50 that I liked was difficult. Um, I don't really like any of these, I'm gonna be honest. I don't, okay, I used to love cargo shorts, but now they're kind of icky. They're kind of icky. They remind me of, like, um... Like, white boys who don't know how to dress. They just wear, like, a t-shirt and, then and, like, cargo pants. And I don't- I don't like that look. It's not a good fit. I need to sit properly. My doctor said I need to sit straight. <laughs> yeah. Nothing that tickled your fancy? Well, I'll have different stuff with me next time, so be sure to stop by. For sure, man. Did we get any new flowers? I almost scared the praying mantises away. Here we got one. Easy. I think spring and summer have to be my favorite seasons in the game. Because everything is just so bright and colorful. I love it. Okay, let's get to watering. Well, I kind of want to talk to Bubbles real quick. I think Bubbles is like my my one of my favorites for sure. Oh, look at that. Not oh, cute. Oh, we can't I thought we could talk to her on the bench. That'd be really cute. But also imagine like a rando sitting next to you on a bench when you're just like chilling. It's a little bit creepy, no? Anyway. <laughs> Good. Huh, Megan, it's been wow, ages. Yeah, it's been ages since I last saw you. Are you away seeing a show or something? Even though your fave pop star is right here on this island? I get it. It's totes important to see the world. Just don't forget to hang out with me sometimes, okay? You got a box? Nah, it's not creepy. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had like anyone approach me. I'm trying to think. Because, like, I've only been asked for, like, my number twice, IRL, and both were at work, so it's, like, it's kind of weird. I, uh, I, hot take, I personally think it's, um, unprofessional to, like, accept or give out your number when you're, like, on the clock in uniform. Like, I, I don't like it. And, like, especially working in service, you're, you're, you have to be nice to your customers. So, like, a lot of people will, like, develop crushes on their favorite worker at, like, the coffee shop, right? And it's, like... Yes, they're being nice to you, but it's their job to be nice to you. Like, don't be weird. Like, don't be creepy. That's my take. <laughs> okay, also, when I did work in service, like, I would be overly nice. Like, I'm low-key a flirt. Like, low-key high-key. <laughs> um, I didn't, like, do anything crazy. <laughs> Mind you. <laughs> but, like, yeah, parasocial Andes, imagine... Okay, there was only one time, one time, guys, where, like, I thought, like, I could be friends with, like, my barista. Because I worked at a sandwich shop, and, like, I'm not gonna say the name. 
everybody knows who knows. Like, you know where I used to work. But, like, like, we would both be, like, really nice to each other. And I was like, maybe this person could, like, be my friend. But, like, I was so scared to, like, ask for their number. To, like, be like, hey, I want to ask for your number. And, like, be friends. It was a girl. It was a girl. Um. But I was like, it still feels weird, right? Because, like, the only time I would see them would be at work. Or, like, if I go and get coffee. And, like, I see them working. But it's like, I wish. I wish. And, like, they would give me free cake pops occasionally. Like, if I went in during, like, closing shift. Because otherwise they gotta throw away. So that she would like sneak me an extra cake pop if I ordered two. Um, I never did that. I never gave her like extra food because you know I don't steal from corporate. Ha. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. Like, like seeing a customer and like knowing what their order is, and like just making it right away. It definitely makes the customer feel more appreciated and more likely to come back because it shows that like you as a worker like genuinely care about like the customers at an individual level. So like if I go in. And, like, they know, like, either my name or, like, they remember something that I talked about, like, the last time I came in. I'm so much more likely to come back. Because, to me, yes, if I like the food or, like, the clothing or, like, whatever service that the business offers, I will go back. But I will always go to a store where I like the workers. Because, to me, the workers make the job and, like, make the business. Like, if you have workers that are, are like, not good workers or... Or like just super rude if there's another location like two blocks down the road i will go to the one that's two blocks away further you know it, and like yeah it's, it's such a nice feeling about it to like to have them like remember you right it makes you feel like a real person That's the one thing I do miss about working in service, is like, having a reason to, I guess, interact with people. Anybody who's new, or new to the channel, I stopped working back in June, so I could focus on one, finishing college, and like, also, I was working basically two jobs. Like, I was work- oh, I need to talk to the campsite. We'll do that later. Like, I was working like, 70-80 hour weeks, so like, I had no time, and it was, it was very stressful, right? Like, I got to the point where, like, yes, I was making decent money. Granted, not higher than poverty, mind you, because just... I'm in Washington State, and, like, minimum wage is fairly high when compared to the rest of the rest of the world, right? But it's still, like, not... It's not it's not a livable wage. No shot. But, like... Anyway, working in service, you, like... You're, like, forced to interact and engage with your customers. And, like, I definitely grew a lot. Like, just learning how to communicate properly and, like... I guess communicating in a way that people like you. I guess like I feel like I gained like so much social skills after working service jobs. Like yes, they sucked, but also I feel like I can talk to someone and not be internally freaked out the whole time. Oh, ladybug! There go easy. Yeah, I agree. I love people too, man. <laughs> okay, I like good people. Like, especially anybody who's work service, you know, you get like some weirdos or some like really mean people. But I think the pro strat is just be like super nice to them. Like be overly kind. Like use your customer service voice. And like that way if they're if they keep being mean, they look like the bad guy, right? Any bad experience at work? Um, I have two... <laughs> yeah, kill them with kindness. Honestly. I have... I think two standout stories. Both during pan... Scared the big fish away! Both, both during pandemic. Um... I think the first story is... This was... Okay, in Washington State, mask mandates are lifted, Sag. Okay, before we talk about this... Um, just a quick thing. Make sure, if you haven't already, get vaccinated. You're helping your neighbors, your friends, your co-workers. Do not, combat, do not combat me on this. You will get timed out or banned. I do not care. So I'm prefacing with that, okay? Anyway. At the time, Master Man did it. <laughs> yeah, Monk <Montgomery> did it. <laughs> That's why I enabled that emote. I think it's so fucking funny. 
Okay, anyway, anyway. So this was when masks were first being mandated, right? And at the time, only people who had a medical exemption could not wear one, right? So I was working front counter because I was a server. And like, if someone doesn't have the mask, you have like a spiel, be like, hey, you have a mask or facial covering? Yes, please put it on. No, we cannot serve you, da 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 da, -da right? It's the same spiel for everyone. It doesn't matter what you look like. It doesn't matter like what you're wearing. I do not care. I will ask that. I, I do not discriminate in that capacity. So like this guy came in um, and he's not wearing a mask. I'm like, hey, I, I do my spiel. And he's like, well, I can't wear one. I'm like, well, He's like, I don't need one. I'm like, well, we can give you one because we had like surgicals to hand out. And he's like, well, I, I, I don't need to wear one. You cannot tell me to wear one. I was like, sir, da, 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 like I cannot serve you the whole spiel, right? And he's like, you know, I'm a disabled veteran. I should not be discriminated against in this capacity. And I'm like, oh my god. I'm like, oh no. And he's like, you know, it doesn't matter. Everyone is still gonna fucking die. And I'm like, oh my god. And like, anybody who's new, like, I'm asthmatic, so I'm moderate risk. So like, if I get COVID, I can be severely ill. So like, people just saying to me, I know, I literally can't. I had one, oh no, oh, 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 oh. Fuck, quick, quick. Okay, dude, no way I could have run away. It's like, I've had people, cause like, I'm younger, right? I've had people like, complain about wearing a mask and like, I don't give a shit, like, if I, like, answer the door, like, getting a package, I put a mask on. Like, I don't care. Like, it's for my own safety, right? Um, like, I've had people, like, customers, like, complain about wearing a mask. And it's like, homie, I work a 10-hour shift. I have to wear this all day. Like, some people re re reuse the mask when they're not supposed to. And it's like, you can't wear it for five fucking minutes. Like, shut the fuck up. Anyway. <laughs> so... Yeah, so the guy was like, you know, everyone's still gonna die, you look young, you look healthy, you're probably fine. I'm like, homie, I could, like, die if you don't wear a fucking mask in here. Anyway, this was pre-vaccine, right? So, like, it was mandatory that it, it made sense for people to wear masks. It's so, like, he was, like, ranting, yelling at me, making me feel like shit, right? And it's like, I'm just doing my fucking job, man. And so, like, he's like, you know, I have PTSD, I cannot wear a mask, like, it, I feel like I'm suffocating. And I was like, okay, sir, not a problem, not a problem. As long as you have medical exemption, I don't give a fuck. Like, if, if people are going to, like, say you can't wear a mask, just open with that. Just say I have a medical exemption. And we're like, okay, got it, boss. That was experience number one, okay? Experience number one. And after that, like, I'm fairly tough. Because, like, at the time I was a supervisor, so, like, you have to be tough, right? But I do not like when people yell at me. Because, like, I know I try and do everything in my power to make sure stuff does not escalate, right? But it's like, you can't, like, help if people are gonna be, like, mean or crazy, right? Like, I can't stop. I can't prevent that. We're talking to Gale again, Sag. <laughs> Interrupt the story time. Okay. Simon and I were just about to try playing a new rhyming game, Snacky. Oh, we can't even see Simon. What is this camera? <clears throat> okay. Oh, can I pick the first card? Okay, I just need something that rhymes with ninja. Yeah. Ninja Blevins? <laughs> Ninja! Oh! I know! Binja! Easy club. I don't think Binja has a real word, Simon. <laughs> you just kind of mashed two words together for that rhyme. Hey, okay, what rhymes with Ninja? Anybody? Can anybody think of anything? Because I honestly can't. I, okay, I, I literally cannot think of anything. <laughs> right, like a mashup of yummy foods. Oh, now I'm thinking about mashing pie up into some ice cream. Apple? Apple? <laughs> no, apple? No, rhyming with ninja doctor. Oh, apple. Okay. Pineapple pen? I have a pen. I have an apple. Pie cream, yeah. Ah, now I'm hungry. Okay, that was stupid. I I cannot think. You're 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 fine. Don't say you're done, though, doctor. Don't say that. I cannot think of anything that rhymes with ninja. Can somebody like look that up on the Thor on like the dictionary.com? <laughs> Antonio. You hear that? There's some kind of scary rustling sound coming from behind you. Huh? Oh, just some paper stuck to you. <laughs> well, uh, I guess my reactions are on overdrive. 
I just wanted to teach you how to show everyone distress. Quit staring, I'm serious. Ginger is ninja. J injure? Okay, I think that's like... I think injure. Ninja, injure. I think injure is like the closest we'll get. Like, it's close enough. <laughs> Finga? Like, finger? But Google said that? No shot. Google was struggling. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. There we go. Third time's the, the charm. Okay, anyway, back to story time. Or actually, let's talk to the campsite guy first. And then we'll go, we'll go into the second story. The second story is crazier. It's actually crazier. Okay, not too crazy. We've never had to, like, call the cops on anybody. Next, okay, we, we did... I wasn't there when this happened, but, like, I was told about it. Um... <laughs> um, the only time we had to call the cops was, like, a guy, um, his pants were down and, like, his genitals were exposed in the lobby and we're like, hey, dude, you can't be doing that. And, like, he stayed, so we had to call the cops and, like, make him leave. It was weird. Hi, everybody, welcome to the chat. Hope you're doing well today. We're chilling with animal- <laughs> Monk and W, what? Yeah, it was wild, dude. You know, like, obviously, um, this person was under the influence, which is fine. Like, I understand people, like, people don't intentionally, like, do drugs and stuff. They usually fall into it. So, like, I, I try and be, like, understanding towards those people. But also, like, make, just make sure you're decent, dude. Like, I don't want to see, like, your frog and balls. <laughs> anyway. That was not the second crazy work story. That was just like an aside. That was like, that was like a C tier story. That wasn't like a real story. Cause like I wasn't there for it, but it happened, you know? Okay, so if we like the campsite villager, okay, the one thing I do not like about campsite villagers is like you can try your hardest to like make them safe, but they can still not like you. And it's all RNG, it's actually stupid. So hopefully, if it's a bad villager, we fail the challenges, and if it's a cute villager, hopefully we win. Because <laughs> we have one empty house left. <laughs> let's see, let's see who it is. Please be Aurora. If it's Aurora, I'm gonna cry. Live on stream. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna be a little bit mean. They look like a clown. They, they look like, you know how in Smash, you can change the color of the character? This looks somebody, like, put the pink skin on Donkey Kong. Oh, I do like the deeper voiced villagers, though. Don't call and D me. Don't do that, baddie. <laughs> I said it wasn't going to be nice, okay? I preface with, hey, I'm going to be a bully. Howdy. I'm just taking a claim for a bit and join the camp in life. You seen you round, huh? Wait, uh-oh, why is he saying uh-oh? <laughs> That's scary. Camp with a whole mess of folks is okay. You can make it a social event if you want. Me? I kind of like the solitary camping experience. That's more my style, uh-oh. Why, why does he keep saying uh-oh? I do not like that. Chill's pretty much all I like when I go camping. Oh, chilly, not chills. Hey, no offense, but... <laughs> Honestly. I preface with like, hey, I'm gonna be a bully. <laughs> Chill is pretty much all I make when I go camping. It's tough to roast it on the stick, though. Uh-oh. Why does he keep saying, oh, I do not like it. I I don't want him. I, I do not want him. Mm -mm. Okay, that's just generic stuff. I Okay, I'm videoing. I do not want him. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I no, don't want, don't want. <laughs> You know that TikTok sound where it's like, don't want, don't want, don't want. <laughs> okay. So since I do not like that villager, we're gonna go ahead and try go for um, a deserted island villager. So I'm gonna drop stuff off in my inventory and then head out. Thank you, fatty. <laughs> um, I love my emotes so much. I have gotten several compliments on them. Thank you, Batty. I love them a lot, honestly. 
Because I just think screenshots emotes are so funny. Because not many people go that route, right? And like a lot of, um, if you look at bigger streamers chats, a lot of emotes that people use in their chat are like the screenshotted ones or like the animated like BTTV ones that are just like them doing an action or like making a face, right? And I just think it's really funny because like I want chat, I said this earlier, but like I want like 80% emote spam and then like 20% like jokes and like funny stuff, right? My store just full oh, end me. Okay, we're just gonna place all the bugs in the house. We are going to make an exhibit so when all the little kids come over, they can see all the cute little bugs I have. Oh, that, that was cute. Did you hear the little whoosh? <laughs> okay. Because like a lot, I see like a lot of people who have smaller streams or channels, they will automatically get like illustrated emotes, which are cute, like they're adorable. But to me, they're a lot less personable. And like, to me, it's harder to like brand it because like it's an illustration, right? And if it doesn't match like your aesthetic, um, it's not as good, in my opinion. But th that's my take. That's my take. Also, like I didn't have money to buy emotes. I will the chat. I waffles here or I waffles was here. <laughs> Hope you're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Otherwise, feel free to lurk, whatever makes you happy. So, like, I might at some point get illustrated emotes made, but I do not have money. So, if any orders want to give me a million subs so I can get some commission, then go for it, dude. <laughs> Otherwise, I think for now, emotes are just going to be screenshots. I'm trying to think, because I have, um, uh, I believe one more regular emote slot that is open, but I, I can't think of anything good. So, Batty, since you're in chat, you I, I assume you're an emote spammer. So if I was to do another screenshot emote, what would you recommend? Or anybody else in chat? Because I have a few ideas, but I don't think they're, like, good enough, right? Because I think, okay, I think my favorite emote of all of mine has to be the animated punching one. This one, god tier. Actually, god tier. This this punching one can be applied to like anywhere. It is so good. Maybe, I was thinking of five head one. I was thinking about it. Okay, let me get a full cam real quick. Let me get a full cam. I have, I have a big forehead. <laughs> like, it is four fingers, right? But, I I'm almost at a five head because I wear my hair back all the time. So like I'm always subconsciously um, pulling my hair back. So like I'm gonna have a five head at some point. So <laughs> I, I think a five head would be a good funny one. Valid, yeah. I love the punching one so much. Oh, the spinning wheelchair is also another good one. I, I love all of them. Because I definitely want to find emotes that like chat will use and like will like using. <laughs> Because to me, like, the sub badges are like, and whatever. I, like, I just purchased, like, um, generic ones off of Etsy. But the um, emotes, like, people pay to, like, subscribe. So, like, I want to make sure chat has emotes that they genuinely like and, like, want to use. So, like, if anybody has suggestions in the future or now, go for it, dude. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and purchase a Nook ticket right now that we can hopefully get a cute villager from the deserted island. <laughs> Saying bye. Oh, thank you for coming to chat in the chat, Doctor. Appreciated chatting and hanging out with you today, man. Hope your day goes well. We got lots of miles now. We had a solid 6k. on TikTok? Let's go. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's ready to go to the island. So I think I just need to drop off a few of my tools and then and then get ready to go. I might need to buy another axe. I don't, because like I have no room in my storage right now, so I don't necessarily need wood right now. 
Why do I have so many axes in my inventory? I literally do not need them all. Yeah, I was thinking a nodding one would be good. It's still kind of like nodders and then nopers. But I don't have another animated slot right now. Like, in order for me to get another animated slot, I need to hit 50 subs. So, Oilers, if you want a Nodders emote, I need 50 subs, guys. Anybody want to drop a fat 50? <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm, I'm goofing, I'm gaffing. Yes, let's put these somewhere else, that way I don't get mixed up with the water again. Not a problem. It's okay. I'm glad you came in to say hi, though. <laughs> Hope you have a great day, Waffles. It's always nice to, like... Like... Because, like, viewership is a number, right? But even if, like, people, like, say hi or bye, like, I still know that, like, real people are here. You know what I mean? So don't feel bad if you can't stay alone. I think... Oh, okay, I think we're ready to go. I don't think I need it. Oh, I, I think I dropped the wrong thing. I do not need the slingshot. <laughs> because I initially had to take that channel point redemptions were kind of mid... But after, like, seeing people use them well, like, that's why I added the say hi and bye. Also, I added some new channel point redemptions over the weekend. If you guys scroll to the very bottom, <laughs> um, if you have a million channel points, I will gift you a tier 1 sub. If you have 10 million points, it's a tier 2 sub. And 100 million points, a tier 3 sub. So, if you redeem that, it's just, like, a solid flex. And... Talking about, like, channel points that I have in other people's channels. Yeah, you're actually a bot baddie. Imagine a bot just spending emotes. <laughs> That'd be actually, like, a cool, like, wholesome bot to have. <clears throat> but, talking about channel points. If anybody doesn't know how they work, I will link you to the Twitch help article to explain them a little bit more. But basically, the more you watch a stream, and the more consecutive streams you watch in a row, the more channel points you accumulate. And I think the channel that I have the most points in, in is is Hassan Albi. I think I have like 550k in his channel. Because I just have his stream on in the background all day. <laughs> and then the second most, I think I have 110k in Mizkip. But okay, one stream I gained like 20,000 from a prediction. So I feel like the numbers are kind of inflated. But to me, like having channel points is like... A, a flex, right? 550k, I know it's insane. Because I've been watching Hassan for almost a year now. So, it's crazy. Like, he doesn't have any good channel for redemptions, though. So it's like, eh. It's just fun to, like, gamble with them with the predictions. Because I think the person who has the most in my channel, I think Cutely, probably, I think Cutely has... I think like 30 or 40k. You never do predictions, but predictions are so much fun! To me, they're like the best part of the stream. That's why like for when I play Mario Kart, I will always have predictions up if I remember to do them. <laughs> Ooh, who's this guy? Ah! There's someone on this island! Oh, <laughs> you're here visiting too? Hey, I'm Benjamin. You're Megan from Timland? Neat! I didn't expect to make a friend here. This island is so cool already. They're not scary. If you have like 110, just put like 1k. It's just 1k did. When you have that many points, it's okay. It's fine if you lose a little. <laughs> this island has so much nature. Every place you look is nature. It's real neat. I can stay here forever, pointing at stuff saying, that's nature. Man, it'd be real neat to live on an island like this. Full time, I mean. Just living life, pointing at nature. <laughs> Wanna come to mine? Huh. You live on Tiblin, right? Is it like this there, too? <laughs> Whoa. Then I gotta go. If your island's as cool as you, then I wanna go, Megan. Huh. Easy clap, guys. No convincing at all. Just loves me instantly. By the way, what should I do to move to Tiblin? So if I call your Mr. Tom Duck, he'll tell me everything? Thanks. I'll call him and say hi. Today's the best day since I found out what spaghetti was. <laughs> okay, let's get to Harvestant. Okay, 
Okay, I don't need any of these flowers. Well, I remember on my initial island save, we went to an island that had all the tulips. And they had all the rare tulips, so they had black, orange, and violet tulips just spawn from, like, the get-go. And I was, like, breaking out. I was like, oh my god, oh my god. Like, actual nice flowers for once. I can definitely understand the argument that channel points or predictions are distracting. But, like, I, not many of my channel point redemptions are stuff that'll, like, derail the stream too much. Like, I think the only one that'll, like, make me stop what I'm doing and doing and do it is the singing one. But that one costs a lot of points, so... It would take a lot to redeem that. <laughs> Because the journal one is at end of stream, so it's not gonna like interrupt anything. It's actually looking for them. Yeah, because like I know me as a viewer, if like we we'll run an ad, <laughs> imagine. Yeah, okay. But yeah, I added the post to Twitter drop as like a meme. Because as I said earlier, the person who has the most points in my channel only has like 30, 40k. So even she doesn't have 50k points. So y'all would have to watch for a long time to get 50k. Um, but none of my Twitter drops are too wild. Most of them are just like gay shit posts and then like kind of edgy stuff. I have really- because like my Twitter- exclamation Twitter in chat, y'all should go follow. I tweet like once a week, so follow for no content. Um, I have this really funny joke that I want to tweet, but I know it's a bit much. <laughs> no, I lost the beetle! Badge. And like I wouldn't I wouldn't let chat choose which draft to post because then I have to show you all of the drafts. So like I would get to choose which would like which draft so I would get to, I would get to choose like the safest one to post, right? And also like um I don't like sad posting or like mad posting online. Like I'll I will talk about stuff on stream, but I don't I won't go out of my way to like make a post. Like, you know how you see on TikTok, like, it's just people, like, fighting all the time? I don't think I will- I don't think I ever see myself doing that. Like, I think drama farming is fine, but when it gets to a point where, like, you're actually making people, like, feel really bad about themselves, I don't think it's okay. Um. But where was I going with that? Oh, so, like, some of my drafts are also, like, vent posts. Um. <laughs> Because, like, when I, like, get upset about something, like, I will write out a tweet draft, like, see it, to feel like I said something, and then I'll delete it. Because I'm like, I don't want to get involved. I don't want to farm drama. Oh my god, that almost got me. Easy. Ah, another carp. Like, my drafts aren't too wild. I'm sad. I haven't caught a snail yet, I don't think. Yeah, writing stuff out like definitely helped invent a little bit. Like I at, at some point when I was younger, I had like a vent journal as with most like edgy kids. <laughs> so like I would just like write cringe poetry. That, like, is so bad. <laughs> because, like, I have this thing to where if I see it out loud to me, that manifests it. So, like, as with most anxious people, like, you have, like, intrusive thoughts at times. But it's, like, once I say it out loud, it's, like, for example, like, you, you can think to yourself whatever you want to, right? So, like, let's say you're thinking to yourself, oh, yeah, I'm stupid, I'm stupid, right? But, like, to me... If it's in my head, it's in my head, but like once I say it out loud, then it kind of makes it real. Like it makes my feelings feel more real. So I just don't like vocalize things if I'm like feeling really self-doubtful. And I find like that's how- that's a coping mechanism that works for me. It's not gonna work for everyone. But... 
Also, don't take advice from like randos on the internet. Like, go see a freaking doctor. <laughs> like, I think, like, seeing. I'm on TikTok a lot more, and I'm not liking it. But I'll see, like, a lot of, like, mental health accounts where it's like, oh, this is how you cope properly. But it's like. Everyone is different. If you are, like, su like seriously concerned, like, see a medical professional. I know. Um, I'm in the process of getting that set up. Okay, guys, if you are like old enough to like set up your own doctor's appointments and not a child, definitely set up your PCP ASAP because um, I have been waiting to see a PCP for two months now for an initial like new patient visit because I don't have my childhood doctor anymore because I'm an adult. <laughs> Imagine. So like definitely get a PCP set up before something happens, okay? Okay? So if you guys are adults and don't have a PCP, literally call and get that set up today. Because I called back in February and in my town God, dude just take the bait. Oh! So like, I, I called trying to get like a, <laughs> yeah, adulting sense. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> so like, I called back in February, wow. right? Cause I was like, you know, I I need to see a doctor. Like I should, like I should give regular checkups, like a real adult. And they were like, oh yeah, you know, there's a long ass waiting list, and you can only schedule a month in advance. So I've been calling like every week to try and get one set up, and I I finally, finally got an appointment for next month. And I've been calling since February, guys. February. I messed that up. So TLDR, if you don't have a PCP, a fucking get one set up. Because it's going to take a while before you can see one. Anyway, that's my- I guess that's my rant for today. <laughs> oh no! I had it! I scared it away! Yeah, honestly. Like, my sister- like, everyone else in the house has a PCP because they got it set up. Because, like, they had issues that had to be addressed. So, like, they got them set up, like, years ago. But I never did because I'm like, you know, I'm healthy, I should be fine. But... You should just always have a doctor, like, assigned to you at least. And... If I would have set this up, like, six months ago, I wouldn't have to wait. I could have- I could have an appointment with my PCP, like, tomorrow if I really wanted to. But since it's, like, a new patient visit, they have to, like, set up all, like, the baseline, because they don't know anything about you, right? They don't have anything on file. Um, so... They always have to prioritize, like, existing patients, which makes sense, right? Makes sense. Valid. But still, like, if something, like, bad happens, I don't have a doctor to go to besides, like, urgent care. And, like, anytime I've had to go to urgent care... Wait, I didn't tell the other customer service story! Okay, we will, we will come back to that. We will come back to that. But I don't, I've only had to go to urgent care and uh, ER a few times. One time, I've told the story before, I'm not gonna tell it again. Um, the YouTube clickbait title, I- I ate glass. <laughs> um, I was accidentally given glass in a smoothie drink. So it was like blended glass shards in my drink. Not fun. So I had to go to the ER. Thankfully nothing bad happened, thank fucking god. Cause like, the shards were small enough. Cause they were the size of like, raspberry seeds, right? So like, very minimal chance of them actually cutting my intestinal length. So, thank god I didn't fucking die. Um, <laughs> and it was funny, because going to the ER, and like, because, like, they always ask you, like, what happened? So, like, all the nurses that helped me were like, oh, really? That's crazy. I'm like, I know, right? <laughs> She's like, that's the wildest story I've heard this week. I'm like, yep. <laughs> um, and then the other care times were just for, like, heart issues. But I'm fine, I'm fine. Because, like, you know when you get anxious, and then, like, your heart, like, beats really fast, and you think you're having a heart attack? But, no, it's just you're anxious. <laughs> Um, those are the only times I got to the ER. Come on, give me the fish. Yeah, <laughs> the cool story, Copium. <laughs> like, the nurses probably went home and, like, told their family, be like, bruh, th this girl ate fucking glass. And they're like, what? <laughs> okay, imagine, like, living with someone who works at a hospital. They they've gotta have some wild stories. Because, like, there's so many just medical dramas on TV, right? Like, imagine- imagine the stories real nurses have. Okay. 
I think I can talk about the second customer service story now that I forgot about it, but we've come back to it. <laughs> that shit? <laughs> yeah. Because, like, my favorite part when I was working would be, like, coming home and telling everybody in the hospital, like, what happened at work, like, some crazy shit, right? Like, that would be, like, the best part of the day. Okay, I think I, since my inventory is still fairly full, I think I'm gonna fish and then head out. <laughs> okay, back to the customer service store. So, the other time. This was during pandemic as well. So, during pandemic, this was peak pandemic, right? So, no vaccinations available. So, our store is very cautious. cautious. We had no dine-in because it wasn't allowed. No public restroom either because our restroom, it was a single unisex room. So, there wasn't stalls. So it was ex it was exclusively for staff use because it was our bathroom because we only have one bathroom in the store. So I do not care if it's your little three year old about to piss their pants. I do not care if you have a diaper. I do not care. There's a bathroom at the safe or um at the store grocery store down the block in the parking lot. Go there, right? At any time, like people will ask you zero and we'll always we always tell them where the nearest public restroom is because like ours is close like as i said it's just a single unisex room that everyone in the store uses and it's, it's, it wasn't safe for like everyone to share and use um because like we did hourly cleanings but it's still not enough right like you have to clean it after literally every person because at that time it was unclear as to how like covid spread so it made sense for like our store owner to be cautious and not let anybody use it like we were it was still in like our legal rights to do that right Anyway, so this family comes in, um, and they order their food, right? We make the food, and at that point it's been like five minutes, and as they, after they pay, they're like, hey, can our son use the restroom? We're like, no, you know, it's close to the public, or safety of the public and our staff members. It wasn't me talking, it wasn't my coworker, because I was on break, so I was like in the bathroom, but I could hear everything was, I was going on, right? And... Um, so like they're making a fit. They're like, why can't we use the restroom? As we said, it's for public use. They're like, hey, can you talk to managers? So I'm like, oh, okay, I gotta go talk to them and tell them the same thing that my coworker told them. Okay, if you guys ever work or like ever go out and you have a complaint and you say, can I talk to the manager? They are literally going to say the same shit that the worker told you. It's not. It's. It's not gonna do anything. It's the most annoying shit, and they get mad. It's like, well. Why would the regular worker tell you something different than what the manager would do? It's fucking dumbass people. Anyway, so they're like, hey, you know, we were told we couldn't use the restroom. Like, yeah, as I explained, under current COVID restrictions and guidelines, we are in full, um, like, we are allowed to restrict bathroom usage. Like, there is one in the store next door. Literally two doors down. Literally two doors down from us, right? And, like, they're making it fit. Like, there's nothing we could really do. I was like, you know... And at that point, there's like five people behind them in line. So like, we're both handling this issue. And then it's like, they're making a big fucking deal out of it. They're not yelling or anything. They're just like making a fit. They're not yelling. They're just like being like... Like, scoffing and shit, right? So I'm just like... And then they leave. It's like, whatever. Whatever the fuck. And like, as they mumble under their breath... Um... I'm Asian Hispanic. My coworker was white. She's a little 16-year-old girl, right? And like, the family was black. I didn't want to mention this from the start because I don't think it was relevant at the time. Anyway, it's so like, as they walk out, um, they mumble under their breath, like, oh, these so-and-so workers, they name the rest of our name, they're racist, you know, they're white, they don't care about us. And it's like, bruh, I'm fucking Hispanic, do you not see that I am brown? Sir? <laughs> I did not say that, but in my head, right? So, so we're just like, whatever, whatever, like, this guy is just, like, upset, and I understand that people do face discrimination, I have faced discrimination in the past because of my gender, race, sexuality, whatever the fuck, right? I know I have as well, but... Dude, I did not let you not use the bathroom because you're fucking black, okay? I, like I said, I do not care if you're about to piss your pants. I do not give a shit. I am i don't want to get COVID from your COVID ass on the toilet, okay? Um, so, like, they were mumbling that under the breath. And we're like, whatever. Like, that was just a weird interaction, right? We get a, co a corporate complaint. And we're like, oh, fuck. <laughs> we're like, God damn it. So, um corporate contacted our owner and the owner was like hey what happened we're like hey this happened and like oh yeah you're fine you're legally fine like they were just like making a big deal out of nothing so like corporate contacted those customers back and they were still like upset but it's like nothing nothing we can really do like corporate supported us they were like you know you did the right thing like you can restrict bathroom usage that's fine um wait how do i open the inventory there we go <laughs> so 
That was on, I believe, a Friday. Guy comes back in on Monday. Different girl working with me. He walks in filming on his phone from the get-go. And we're like, oh no. Right? Because, like, you know how you see, like, the Karen videos online? And it's, it's never the worker's fault. Right? It's literally never the worker's fault. It's always the customers, like, either being petty or just being fucking brain-dead stupid. Right? And it's like, I understand you have the right to film people in public, but in a private space, you can restrict who's filming. Keep that in mind, okay? So, I'm in the back, like, doing prep, and my coworker's up front. No one else is in the lobby, it's just this guy, right? And he starts filming. He's like, hey, I came into this restaurant last week. They refused me to use the bathroom. They didn't let me, let me, let my son use the bathroom. Um, so, and they're filming all this, right? I'm like, I tell my coworker, hey, so-and-so, go to the back. I don't want you to be on camera, right? Because she wasn't involved with the initial incident, right? So she goes to the back. She doesn't know what's going on, right? Because, like, what the fuck, right? This guy just came in doing weird shit, right? So I say, um, sir, I understand your frustrations, but can you please not film? We do have minors working. Can you please not film us? And he's like, you know, I don't care. These people here are racist. Saying this to the fucking brown girl, okay? Dude. <clears throat> he's like, you know, these workers here are racist, they didn't let me use the bathroom, I called corporate, the corporate said they were in the right, but you know, they're still fucking racist. He's like, you know, we're gonna come back, I'm gonna get all my friends, I'm gonna post this on Facebook, this is gonna blow up, I'm gonna get all my friends, you don't know what's gonna happen. And then he leaves and walks out. And it's like, bruh. Did he just, like, film and threaten us? Bruh. Um, at that point, we called corporate back, and we are like, hey, this happened, they were like, oh, what the fuck, right? They were like, you know... Megan, you did the right thing. There was nothing you could really do. Like, that guy is probably just crazy. They were like, you know, if the guy comes back, call the police right away. Um, we did have camera feeds, so we know who the guy was. <laughs> so if they came back, we wouldn't know. But it was wild. Like, actually wild. Anyway, the guy didn't come back. Thank fucking God. <laughs> so, yeah, that, I think that has got to be the craziest story. Anyway. <laughs> and like, on that note, like, I know I've been discriminated against, but like, I don't- I don't call it out, because that's not gonna help your situation, right? It's like, not that you should take it, but like, if it's going to lead to an escalated situation, it's not worth- literally not worth. Like, I understand you wanted to stand up for yourself, but like, don't take it too far, you know? You know? Okay, I think we are good to go. Yeah. I got all that I needed. Ooh, big fish. Let's, let's see if that's a good one. Airplane yellow? I feel like the airplane was yellow. Has it always been red? Am I just colorblind? I'm actually not colorblind. If I was colorblind, I would cry. Who knew fish? Okay, we're gonna do something bad. We're gonna do something bad. We're going to litter. We are going to litter. We're gonna leave this tire on the dock. Nobody narc. Nobody say anything, okay? Got it, chat? Be quiet. Be quiet. No narcs. Yeah, exactly. It's like, dude, I'm not gonna let anybody use the bathroom. It's like, homie, it's not all about you, okay? Yeah, I mean, like, I understand why people will instantly think it's that. Whether it be like discrimination, but it's not. Unless it's like, it was different if, if I was being like outwardly hateful and like said like mean or discriminatory stuff. But no, it, it's not that. And it it like honestly it hurt because I try and be as like understanding as I can, right? But it, it's it's all because like people will instantly think it's that reason because they have experienced that trauma in the past, right? It's hard not to immediately think that's the reason why you don't get your desired result or outcome, right? 
but it it's sad. We will get there one day, but we're not fully there yet. <clears throat> yeah, I feel it. it. It's hard not to, like, assume the worst of people, right? Especially when you've experienced, like, bad things, right? <laughs> one day praying. <laughs> one day, yep. Yeah. That's why, like, I don't get too- like, in the moment, I was, like, annoyed and perturbed. Like, especially since the guy was filming, that was, like, not okay. But, like, after the first interaction, I was like, you know, I understand why he felt that way. Like, I honestly do. Okay, let's see. Let's go sell some stuff. Just survived your AC SATs? Let's go, Asa, let's go. Came just in time for you to laugh, you lose, man. Hope you're doing well today, Asa. <clears throat> Is not playing the video? Is your just like internet bad, Sag? Sad day. Well, at least you can still hear me, huh? Really? Is there like a Twitch server outage? Imagine. As long as my VOD is fine. Because, Issa, I know you were in chat yesterday. My VOD after the stream after was fucked. Why didn't you tell me, Issa? Why didn't you tell me there's drop frames and audio peaking? Popping, like, every fucking five seconds. Issa, why didn't you tell me? I'm not mad. <laughs> I said it early in stream. I don't know if you were in chat, Issa, but, like... If any time any of you guys in chat notice that something isn't... Isn't normal. Like, if you notice that there's an excessive amount of drop frames. Or, like, if you notice audio is, like, kind of fucking up. Like, make sure to tell me. Um... Because a lot of the times, I do have, like, my live feed open so I can see stream, but I can't, like, see it all the time, right? Thank you, Batty. I appreciate it. <laughs> Nodders. I love the Nodders emote so much. It's so good. Um, but, like, if you are here for, like, a few streams, like, you know what the normal is, right? Because, like, my laptop setup is pretty good. Like, I haven't dropped any frames this stream. Let's go. So, like, my setup is pretty good. So, like, once you watch a few streams, you'll know what the standard is in terms of, like, stream quality, like, resolution or, like, frame rate. Like, if you see something is wrong, like, tell me. Um, because a lot of people fail to realize that streaming, you're doing it by yourself, so... You're, you're not- you don't have a full, like, tech crew. Or, like, a film crew, right? So you don't have someone monitoring the live feed at all times and, like, making sure everything is good and A-OK, -okay, right? So... For me... If you notice something is wrong, say something. And if something is not wrong, I will tell you. But if something is wrong, I will say praises and say thank you. Because I want to make sure um, I have like the best quality stream tech-wise I can with what I have available to me, you know? <laughs> that is all. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go. I need to upgrade my storage. Do I need to talk? I think I need to talk to Tom Nook. Or go to the mile stand, I believe. Because I need to upgrade my storage. <clears throat> or can I not upgrade my house until KK comes? If so, then that sucks. That is not cool. Because I am a hoarder, I need to keep everything. About my home. Okay, okay, let's see, let's see. Okay, so, you'd, li you'd like to talk about your home, huh? Oh, but there's something I should tell you first. Oh no, oh noted. Okay. Along with layout assistance, I'm also ready to help when residents want to move their homes. That's something we can do even if you're still repaying your loan. If you're interested, tell me. Alright, I kept you waiting long enough. How can I help you? I want to expand. Yes, we can upgrade the inventory. No! Oh! oh! Okay. Hmm, I hate to disappoint, but I can't take expansion requests while you have an outstanding loan balance. Bro, you just said I could move my house, but I can't upgrade my house? This is bullshit. Remember, you can make payments to the Nook Stop anytime. Once you pay off your loan, let's chat, okay? <laughs> yeah, Tomino just cucked me right there, dude. <sighs> That's frustrating. Okay, let's see, let's see. 
Oh, 98k. I think. Okay, okay. I know I, I have a big bag of money outside. I can pay that off right now. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there we go. How much is it? No! I thought it was 99k! Fuck me! Oh, there it is. Okay, we're good. We're saved. We're saved. I know I had a big old bag of money outside. I need to get new glasses. These ones keep falling down. And it's been two years, so I definitely need a new prescription. Badge. What sucks is that- Okay, I don't have a job, so I'm on state insurance, right? State insurance doesn't cover dental or eye care. Mean. It's mean. Or wait, it covers- No, wait. Yeah, it does not cover eye care. Which to me, like- Dentistry and eye care is like the most common thing you need. <laughs> Easy. Debt repaid. Easy clap. Okay, let's go talk to fucking Tom Nook now. Okay, my stomach is starting to grumble. It's almost lunchtime, Sag. Ooh, I still have leftover Taco Bell breakfast from yesterday. I'm so excited. Taco Bell breakfast? God's here. Fight me on it. Oh, okay. I must offer a hearty congratulations. You've paid off your loan in full. I expect nothing less, of course. But such a milestone is certainly cause for celebration, huh? I suppose they're also a good time to take stock and reflect. Yes, yes. I'm sure your home is quite comfy in its current configuration, but what if it could be bigger? <laughs> oh, I assume that it can indeed be bigger. There's jokes, there's jokes. A bigger home means more space for furniture and more storage, too. And that I've introduced some possibilities, I will leave it at that. Can you please come me. Do please come see me if you'd like to hear more, huh? Yes, sir. Let's see. I want more storage, baby. Uh, hello, hello. How can I help you? Give me that sweet storage. Time to talk about your home, hmm? What shall we discuss? I want to expand. I want to expand. Please. <clears throat> hmm. Well, for your home, I think I'd recommend making the room larger. That would require taking out a lot of... A loan of 198,000 bells. Interested? Yeah, let's do it, boss. Let's do it. Wonderful. I'm so happy for you. I'm gonna make sure construction begins right away. Oh, it occurs to me. This might be a good time to consider a new color for your roof, don't you think so? There are eight color options. Could you please select a roof cover for them this list? Mm. A yellow roof would be icky. There are four other options. Choose one of the one of these or one of the previous colors, okay? It doesn't let me preview it. I'm trying to think. If we get a blue roof, then it'll blend in with the sky, making our house invisible. <laughs> that was a dumb joke. Um, I like the red roof a lot. I feel like that's vintage, that's classic. We used to have a red house, but now our house is green. <laughs> okay, construction on your home should be finished up by tomorrow. I'll bet you'll be even more excited than I am. Um, why can't it be done now? Why can't we hire a hundred people and just upgrade my house now? Dude, capitalism has ruined me. Like, just expecting things like, in wait, instantly? It has ruined me. Okay, well, since my storage is still full, that means we have to place everything outside of the house. That way everyone in town knows that I'm a hoarder. I like to make sure I have three of every creature. That way when Flick or the fish otter guy. I can never remember their name. Comes into town. I have. Can I not place it on top? 
Oh, I guess not. I can make sure, like, I have them in my inventory, that way I can get the collectibles. Madge. I think Madge is one of my favorite <laughs> Pepe emotes. It's so good. Madge and Sag is definitely, like, top five for me. I'm glad you're having fun with the emotes, Batty. I'm glad you're utilizing them. I'm trying to convert all my new chatters into emote spammers. That is my goal. Look at us just littering Gale's backyard with our junk. We are the worst neighbors, guys. I can't even put like the iron and stuff. Okay, I think I think we are good for today. We have a new villager coming in for the deserted island. We did not get a new pit check, Sag. We watered our flowers. Um, I would harvest the tomatoes, but honestly don't really need to because I literally do not have any storage space. But I think we can go ahead and call it a day here. Okay, let's save. Let's not exit the game without saving. <clears throat> okay. Y'all know what time it is? It is. You laugh, you lose time. I'm gonna go ahead and get that set up for you guys. Oh, okay, I thought I pressed the wrong button. We're fine, we're saved. Okay, let's hope stream does not F again. Oh, it captured the right window! Let's go, let's go. Okay. I just muted myself by accident, Sag. Okay. Changing my title, give me 10 seconds. Okay, so anybody new to stream, we do a you laugh, you lose segment at end of stream. As you know, like a little cool down, get some goofs and gaps and giggles out. Rules are simple. If I laugh, I end stream. If chat laughs, you type one in chat. Also, if you guys are going to be chatting, um, type one if you laugh. Tell me what made you laugh. And also make sure your jokes are appropriate. Okay, no hateful or bigoted jokes. Got it? Got it. Also, hey, what is this? It is my YouTube channel. If you haven't already, go subscribe. New videos out sometimes. Okay, go subscribe. Okay, please. We're trying to beat PewDiePie, guys. We can do it. We can do it. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, rules. I... Wait, is my volume on? I cannot pause. I can smile, but I cannot laugh. Got it? Got it. Wait, one second, one second. Oh, wait. Wait, you guys can't hear it. One second. I will fix that for y'all. I was capturing the wrong, wrong audio. Is this it? Let's see, let's see. Sorry. One second. I changed my, like, audio sources recently. So... Is it capturing it now? Nope, Sag. Why is it not capturing? Mods. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's why. Okay, I found I found the right audio source. Let's, let's go. I am a pro streamer. Okay, is it capturing now? I figured it out! I figured it out! <laughs> okay, we're restarting, we're restarting. Get the fuck out 
Like it's a bit loud. Okay, I can fix it. I can fix it. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it, buddy. Like, like I said, thank you for telling me if there's any tech issues. Oh, it is really fucking loud. Sorry. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Okay, that that should be better. That should be better. It's not on the part, you Oh my god. That's why I don't ever want to go golfing. Look at little rat. Hello, little rat. You are so cute. What are you? Are you a rat? I don't know. Hey, That's what you get for like actively trying to talk to a rat. Deserve. The rat got you. Nice. They were just going for it. <laughs> oh, not cool. Not cool, man. Oh, this this one's so good. Oh Jesus Christ, this is so unsafe. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, I fucked up. Look what I have. <laughs> I had to work out. That dog was a little bit too excited. Here comes the right. You know that your bumper's in his car. Yeah. That's not good. No. What? Come on. No. How are you gonna do that? Oh, you fucking did it. Oh shit. Oh, they almost had it. In 15 seconds. I hope he's what I would die, like actually die. Me chugging sluggish cheese yesterday. Oh, bro, that's a huge ass paragraph, bro. Why do you have four squirrels in your house? People who keep like wild animals as pets, actual sociopaths. Dude, if I had a pet, I'd be popping off on TikTok. I need to get a hamster. I, I need to do it. Deploying flashbang. <laughs> ah, you stupid. <laughs> it's like a squeaky toy. You squish it and it makes a noise.
All right, bro. Good night. Good night. All right. Oh, shoot. I forgot to get my water. Adding like the crying sound effect has got to make anything funny. They can take our lives, but they, they can't take the fitness gram pacer test. Some people have too much free time. I almost wait, wait, wait. I almost did that with like my bed frame. Like, is scary shit. Like, don't move furniture by yourself, kids. Don't do it. Not worth. What, what the oh, fuck? Oh. What the fuck is that magic? <laughs> it's magic. <laughs> okay. What the fuck? That one got me. That one got me. Is it marbles in the cup? Pour it. That's cool. Oh, he's barrel là-bas. Oh, he's barrel là-bas. Oh, he's barrel là-bas. Ah, nice, nice. I didn't like completely throw. <laughs> okay, it was a good video. Chinchillas are so expensive, literally not worth it. Do not do it, chat. Don't do it. Too expensive. Okay. Good times. Good times. Okay. So, I think that is going to be all for today's stream. Thank you to anybody who came to chat. Any viewers, lurkers, chatters? Um, it was fun today. Mario Kart wasn't that bad. Honestly, I did a fairly decent. As I said earlier, at start a stream, we might do Super Mario World tomorrow. Depends on if I can buy it. Um, if not, we'll probably be doing Pokemon Unite. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Ben. Um, I don't know if anybody I know is live right now. Let us see. Let us see. Oh my god, Hassan's live. Imagine raiding out to Hassan. <laughs> okay, Downs is live again. Fuck out. We can raid out to Downs. Anybody new to chat? We are going to be heading over to my friend Downs' channel. If you are a sub, or if you are a non-sub, feel free and copy Peace Raid. If you are a sub, you can go ahead and do Peace and Spin, and then Peace Raid, Peace I2 Spin. Just a reminder, be nice to them, because anyone we do raid out to are my friends. So if you are rude to them, you will be no longer welcome here. So keep that in mind. Um, I enjoyed hanging out with everyone today, and I will be back tomorrow. If you want to see more of my offline stuff, check out my Twitter or my Instagram. Please go follow my TikTok. Go follow my TikTok right now. <laughs> I am hopefully planning on doing art streams there at some point, but you'll just see clips and highlights from streams, so feel free and check that out. Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. I will be in Downs' chat for a little while. When we do right out, don't feel obligated to chat if you don't feel comfortable. That is totally fine. I totally get it. I spelled his user wrong. Right now, he is playing WWE 2022. And he is making customized characters for chat and other streamers. I can never spell his username right. <laughs> I am... Okay, there, I figured it out. So, good time. His laugh? He's British. Like, his laugh is so contagious, guys. Honestly, a pleasure to watch. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. Hope you all have a good day. Bye.